y'all. It's American Mom. I am going to be reacting to the second part of the pilot of Lost. I didn't realize it was in two parts. So I did the first part last week and today will be part two. Um, a lot of stuff happened. Like the beginning was this just mayhem of a plane crash and we didn't see the plane crash, but it was like the aftermath of it. And then uh, Jack is one of the main characters, Kate and then Charlie. Uh, I remember them. They went off on a mission to try and find the the cockpit so they could get like a, um, a radio signal. And they, anyway, they learned from the pilot that they're like a thousand miles off course before the crash even happened. So if people are looking for them, it's in the wrong place. And then he got snatched up by what I can only think of is, is like a, something like from Jurassic Park. <laughs> what was that? Uh, but yeah, Jack was, is, um, he's a doctor in real life. Uh, he and Kate are kind of connecting. She helped stitch him up. Something might happen there. Um, we'll probably meet some more characters and some more character names. Um, I know some of y'all have already put them in the comments for me. And uh, I didn't have a chance to like... I've been reacting like every day so with these new shows but um i will i will learn all the names um of everybody and i'm just excited to see what the second part is because now like are they going to return back to the beach and be like you know do they tell everybody hey there's something you know because i mean they hear they hear something and they know this, that there's something out there but do they say like it's huge and it just killed the pilot and no one's looking for us or do they keep that to themselves and try and figure something out i don't know let's just find out what happens it's really good so far so i'm excited all right let's do this what were you doing in the bathroom i thought you could tell i was getting sick puking my one tangible contribution to the trek no i'm glad you came charlie Every track needs a coward. I'm not a coward. Don't look for it. Are you a bad guy on this show, Mary? I'm Charlie. Is he going through like some like drug withdrawals or something? Oh god, now she's reporting. <gasps> Is this when he runs past Jack? For the turbulence. Excuse me. Yeah. Really oh, we're gonna see it from everybody's angle, everybody's point of view. Okay. Sir, are you alright? She's off at their foot. This is a long time ago. Hey, we're going through some clothes, sorting them. See you found your bag. She's the daughter from uh, Taken. Is that your boyfriend? I remember this from last time. I don't remember if I said it. My brother. Hey, uh, have you, uh, have you seen my boy? I don't know. I 영어를 못해요. 이 단추가 열렸네. 채워라. 빨리. Really? Oh, he's a pleasure. I don't want that thing to find you. Why are you not with your father? plane wreckage around, so that came from the plane. Hey guys, come on. Hey. hey! Break it up! Break it up! Look, my kid found these in the jungle. And this guy was sitting in the back row of business class the whole flight, never got up. Hands folded underneath the blanket. Oh. And for some reason, just pointing this out, 
The guy I saw next to him didn't Thank make you it. Thank so much for observing my behavior. You don't think I saw him pull you out of line before we board him? Oh, come on, bring it! Whatever you say, Doc. You're the hero. I might not like him either. I don't know. You guys found a cockpit? No. Yeah. Any survivors? No. Hurley. Oh, just... Said. Yeah. Fast friends. How do you know how to do all that? I was a military communications officer. There is one thing we could try. What? Seeing if we can get a signal from high ground. How high? Said, fix the transceiver, but we can't use it. Not from here. Kate, wait a You're minute. You're the one who said that we had to send out a signal. Look, you saw what that thing did to the pilot. Yeah, I did. What makes you think we're any safer here than we are in the jungle? I don't know why he wants them isolated not to talk to anybody else, okay? He just slapped her hand. Thank you. No, thank you. No way, no. <laughs> Kids, don't do drugs. And he's gonna run out, and then what's gonna happen? She's not going. She doesn't the want hell to go. I'm not. what she does. She pops. You don't know what the hell it's I really do. really bad decision to upset her family, which at the moment is me. Shut up and stop trying to be charming. I'm coming with you. I don't know if that's such a good idea. What are you, two years older than me? Please. You're going, are you? Yeah, are you? <laughs> yep. Yeah, I'm definitely going. Look, everybody can come, but we're leaving now. I bet he was in the handcuffs. He's blaming Saeed. I don't know why it matters right now. We're on an island. Unless they, somebody's was being transported for murder. Ah, that's different. He decided to join us. I'm a complex guy, sweetheart. Uh-oh. How old is he? Nine. Ten. Ten. Walt's more worried about his dog than anything. The dog was on the plane, so... Kids, you know. He's at a lab? Yeah. Yeah? I saw him yesterday in the jungle. What? Where? Over there, a couple hundred yards in or so. He looked good. Over there. He looked good. He survived from the bottom of the plane? Well, I mean, I know he did. I'm just. Who are you? She got sick. She died a couple of weeks ago. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. I guess. Clay. Whatever that is with him. What was that backgammon? I can't tell. Whoa. Do you want to know a secret? Yes. Why are we zooming in like that? You go. Contraction? Just sitting. Just sitting. Okay, there's Jack there. I just felt it. I can't feel this. I know, Just check the damn radio. We might just check. We might not have any juice left when we get to. What is that thing? What? Why does he have a gun? That's a bear. What is that? Hey, guy, you awake? <laughs> Yo, there's a rescue plane. We're saved. Yay! <laughs> yeah, he's out. <laughs> I like him. Hey, don't even think about it, Hurley. Don't even think of Hurley, hey! Damn it! I knew, I knew it's I called bear. It's, it's a, a polar, polar bear. bear. Wait a minute. Polar bears don't usually live in the jungle. Spawn. Right. No, polar bears don't live near this far, sir. This one does. 
did. It did. Where did that come from? Yes. Probably Bear Village. How the hell do I know? Not the bear, the gun. The gun. I got it off one of the bodies. One of the bodies? Yeah, one of the bodies. People don't carry guns on planes. They do if they're a U.S. Marshal, sweet cheeks. There was one on the plane. How do you know that? I saw a guy lying there with an ankle holster, so I took the gun. Thought it might come in handy. Guess what? I just shot a bear! So why do you think he's a marshal? Because he had a clip-on badge. I took that, too. Thought it was cool. I know who you are. You're the prisoner. I don't know what. You found the gun on a U.S. Marshal? Yes, I believe you did. You knew where it was because you were the one he was bringing back to the States. Cocktail? And we're gonna get Soda? her perspective. Just coffee, sweetheart. Black. You sure you don't want some more juice? Yeah, she sure. said he was beside her on the plane. This fight, it's been playing over and over for 16 years. Someone else was stranded here? Guys, where are we? Exactly. Well, I'm still lost. <laughs> where are they? How did somebody get stuck there? 16 years prior, but they got that transceiver from the plane that they were just in. They've just killed a polar bear. I thought he was the criminal trying to blame Saeed because he was profiling him as a terrorist and he was just kind of like, everybody look at him, he's the, but then he whips out the gun. Mm. Okay, so he found the gun that marshal that Jack just saved, asking where Kate is. Okay, that's why she said he was sitting beside me last time, last, last episode, she said that. Ooh, I don't know what she could have done. He said that uh, maybe they'll believe your story or something. She was like, I don't care. Oh my gosh, I have to know what it is. So he was transporting her back. Now Jack's gonna know. Whatever it is. But she's gone. What's with the what's with 16 years? This is so weird. There's a polar bear in the jungle in the jungle. And Charlie said, and you know, this was a small one. What we saw was a bigger one. Which is true, it had to be like above the trees to get the, you know. Gosh. This is really weird. Uh, some other stuff kind of happened in there. The, 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 um, the pregnant girl um, couldn't feel the baby. But that, that happens when the baby's getting bigger. Like she's, you know, she's going to have the baby any day now. And as it gets bigger, there's not room in the belly for it to move. I know this, but, um, so I thought she was going into labor all of a sudden. Then I was like, oh, I'm so glad Jack is still on the island, but he needs to stay near her anyway, because she could have the baby at any minute and he needs to be nearby. So I'm glad he didn't go on that little hike. Um, but she was just feeling, she finally felt a contraction. That was like a little funny moment. She was like grabbing the Chinese guy's hand who is, I, I don't know. It's, I don't know if if, he, if this is kind of his um, his way of like with 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 the way his his culture and how he was brought up is with his telling his wife to button the top part of her sweater. You know she's hot, and there's nobody around them. He's he's isolated them from the beginning. Um, I like Saeed. Charlie's a goof. Now okay, so he's a druggie, and once 
those drugs are gone. He can't get any more. So we're going to see some withdrawals from him. He's going to be tripping. We saw a little bit of interaction with um, the older gentleman and Walt, who is determined to look for his dog. And his dad was just like, I'll get you another one. You don't say that. This isn't the time. It's too soon. It's too soon to say, I'll just get you another dog. But Jack just saw the dog. I guess this is the next day. Um, so the dog was okay, unless it was eaten by something. I don't want to see that. I don't want to see if they find it. But hopefully he finds his dog. But he had a little moment playing backgammon with um, the older guy. So they might have like a little friendship, you know, like a like an, an older generation with the with the young kid. He's been through a lot. Said his mom just passed and he's heading back to the States. And he said, You've had a bad month. I'm thinking, yeah, bless his heart. I think the thing for the main concept for this second part of this episode um, was them making the hike to the top to get the transceiver to work, which now is totally confusing with the 16 year loop that's going on and on. But at least, uh, I don't know, that's, they got it to work. That was part of it. Um, and then uh, we know that Kate was the one in the handcuffs. I wanna know what she did. Jack's gonna find out. That'll probably be the next episode. Yeah, I mean, he, the, the marshal, uh, first thing he says is, where is she? So he said it like she's dangerous. I don't know. It's really good though. This is, this is good. I'm, I'm enjoying it. You know, sometimes there's not anything to, anything to really say. You just, you're just watching stuff happen, but, um, but I like the storytelling of it and it's, it's, it's pretty easy to, to follow for the most part. I know that there's some things I'm kind of like, what? That might be answered later. I've been warned that that could happen and to stick with it and it's fine. So yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. Um, you can leave comments down below. The, uh, the DST for, for this show will be going through those and I'll look over them within the next couple days. Um, and I appreciate y'all watching this with me as always. And until the next video and the next time. Bye.